ourselves ready for school. I know this weekend was tax free weekend. It's a rip off. They hike everything up anyway. But anywho, all right, no, no, don't fall into the hype. But everything that has been poured into you. Going to third grade, fifth grade, second grade, first grade, kindergarten, pouring into you. Pouring into you. Your teachers, the custodians, the principal, the crossing guard, the lunch lady. The people that's preparing all these things for you. Y'all, some of us are going to the backpack giveaway. People that have donated mm -hmm. and pouring into you. We thinking about you all. This school year is like your Olympics. That's right. Mm -hmm. How you gonna walk in there? Mm -hmm. We walk in there first few days. We fresh and so clean. Got our new kicks mm -hmm. on. Got our new backpack. Yep. Brand new pencils. And buying the, the match. If you saying Puma, Adidas, Nike, just do it. it. We get all the top brand stuff. We fall out in the store for mom and them because we want that name brand stuff. Mm. But you don't need it. Mm. Because this is your purpose. Amen. You're the brand. That's right. Mm. You Amen. are the brand. So this school year, we kicking it off. We walking in there. Hey. This is Club Odie. That's right. This is Odalisa's brand. Minister Odalisa, this is what I'm walking in. This is what I'm showing you all. Mm. I'm going to convince y'all so much that you're going to want to be like me. Mm. And you say, well, what do you mean, want to be like me? I don't mean like this. I want you to get what I got. I want you to get what I got. And you say, well, what, 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 what you got that, that, that makes you all that? I got God. I got God's 
favorite. He told me just this morning, I'm his favorite. And you said, well, wait a minute. He told me the same thing. Yes, in your ear. But in my ear, he told me, get up, child. You're my favorite. I got a purpose for you today. And I said, well, yes, sir. And yes, Lord. And I got on up, and he just started showing me things. And y'all say, well, wait a minute, Minister D. Back that up a little bit. Show me some proof that God has some favor. That's all right. I'm going to tell you. I'm going to take y'all over to, and you all have heard this before. It's 1 Peter 2 and 9. You have get heard that before, Bible. And you're going to giggle when you hear it because you're going to be like, no, we don't know that one. We don't know that one. All right. No, so everybody yeah. stand up. And let's find Let me tell part. you what it said. Wait a minute. They're going to find it. What was the scripture again? It's, 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 it's in 1 the, Peter, which is in our New Testament. All right. It's closer towards the back. It's almost, you know, almost feel like you've got to fall off into Revelation, but you're not because John going to stop you. First John going to stop you. All right. It's right after James. 1 Peter is right after James. And before First John, I know some of y'all might heard I John, but it's First John. Amen. Amen. I know y'all giggle, but y'all hear that, and then you'll be like, "Oh, Minister D mentioned that." All right. Hold on. Now here's what I want to talk to you a little bit about, because this scripture talks about building, building, and when we build a building, we build it with rocks, stones, or whatever have you. And they talk about this stone that could make you crumble. And you've heard about the stone that the builders rejected. But watch this. First, first Peter, second chapter, the ninth verse says, but you, but you, let me hear you say that, but you, but you are a chosen people. Just like when you went to the store, you wasn't hitting that bottom rack, you looking up top. You chose. You are a chosen people. A royal priesthood. Mm. Oh, wait a minute. Hold up. I said royal. Mm. Yeah. Royal. Mm. Put your crowns on. Hold yes. your heads up. Show a royal that. priesthood. A holy nation. Come on. Holy nation. Not just any type of nation. That's the favor. Yes. Holy means to be set apart. Set aside. Has favor. Okay? A people belonging to God. Yes. A people belonging to God. So who in they ask who you are? I'm God's people. God made me. I'm his favorite. He loves what he made. Now, because I belong to God, that you may declare the praises of him who called you out of the darkness into his Wonderful light. Mm. Yes, indeed. So that's why when people look at you, some of them go, hey, because they try to figure out why you shine so bright. Because it didn't say any type of light. It said a wonderful light. It's more than you can imagine light. So when I say we have purpose, you have a purpose. God didn't make no jump. So when you sitting in that classroom, there's a reason why you got that teacher, why you're sitting in that class, why you're sitting in that seat, why you were chosen for the position that you were chosen for. Some of you all will get upset. Well, every day I'm not the line leader. No, you don't have to be the line leader every day. Come on. But you will practice. Yes. Practice for your purpose. For when you are the line leader. So you will always walk straight in line. Nobody gonna have to tell you get ready because you won't already be ready. Amen. Well, well, teacher didn't pick me when I had the answer, but you won't always you have the answer know. because your purpose is you're gonna already be prepared. You are gonna already be studied up. You're not gonna be well, don't pick me. You're gonna be like, yes, I know that answer. And if I don't know the answer, I got a question so that I can get that answer. Because see, young people, in this time and age, you all might not have paid attention, but right now, the nation is in, uh, is in uproar. Yes. We're taking a break. We're over here watching the Olympics and everything like that. But yes. the United States is concerned. Right now, we're trying to figure out who's going to lead us next. Mm. Now, let me rephrase it, because I did say we're trying to figure out who's going to lead us next. We're trying to figure out what 
human. We gonna put in position to call a leader. Okay? But you all in here, you all understand. Who do we follow? God. Okay? So we already know who to follow. But the, the nation here is concerned. Because some people are already going, I can't follow no woman. I'm following she ain't her. black. She never said she was black. Just like Obama and all them, they presented their birth certificate. She Indian, Kukla Major, da 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 We all are too. Ain't nobody sitting up here pure black. Come on, y'all, stop lying. We done been segregated, alienated, and mixed so much. Please. So don't even get caught up in she ain't black. She's a woman. Is she qualified? Come on, that's, that's what we're looking that's at. The court. That's yeah. the question. Well, she was only the vice president. And I love the people who saying it. Because y'all, you only a citizen. You didn't get to be the vice president. Some of y'all ain't even been a vice president in the penny club. Because you ain't got the penny to even be the vice. So I can't judge. But I know that she's qualified because she's made it closer than I ever will. Well, then the other people say, well, I don't want to be dumped and follow Trump. Okay, we followed him for a minute, did we not? We got caught up before. Okay, and then we prayed. Okay, well, I don't want to follow him because he's a convict. Like, we all ain't done some dirt. We just ain't been caught for it and stand up and, hello? Here's the thing, he's qualified too. All right? And has been closer than I ever will be. So what I really can do, and all that I can do, is pray for them. Amen. Right. And I'm going to pray for their running mates. I'm going to pray that they put somebody on their team that even if they get up there, because they don't falter in the run, because they're human. One. The other reason they don't falter in the run, I don't hear them professing who their true leader is. Mm. So I already know they gonna fall short. Now, do I have to be concerned about that? Do I have to be anxious about that? Mm -hmm. No, because my God already told Come me, on. be anxious mm -hmm. for, for nothing. nothing, but in mm -hmm. prayer and supplication. Come on. That's all I have to do. So really, as we prepare for this, all I got to do is what? I got to pray just to make it today. I know I stole that, but hey, it's my motto. It's my chance. It is what's getting me through. Because I don't want to have anxiety. I don't want to have to pop a pill. I don't want to cry, break down, none of that, because of what might happen, because it ain't happened. All I know is God got me. And my purpose is to do what God has told me me to do. That's all I got to do. And I know sometimes I want to argue. I want to fight. I want to argue even with God and be like, I don't want to. But I realize the more that I follow God, it's getting easier and easier. I'm going to say it again. The more I follow God, it's getting easier and easier. It's a habit and I'm doing it by rote. I'm doing it because it's muscle memory. Yes. Muscle memory. And that's what they use in the Olympics. Muscle memory. Because you can practice and practice and practice and practice and practice wrong. Yes. But it's muscle memory. Those people were able to scale those walls because they weren't really looking at the rock, rock. Rock, it was muscle memory. The hands and the feet knew climb, 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 alternate, 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 and that final lunge. Some of them didn't get a good start out the gate. The muscle memory failed them. And when it did, there was milliseconds that were taken off. Okay? Let's get to my girl Simone. Simone oh, yes. Hallelujah. Hello. Let's go get over there. Okay, <laughs> to jump up there on that beam, mm -hmm. y'all, you yeah. seen it? Eye yeah. contact to her. Mm -hmm. This beam ain't on the floor. It's mm -hmm. all the way up in there. It's up here. Yes. And this girl I'm talking about da, 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 da. <laughs> and landed. Yeah. This is me. Da, 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 da. Okay. 
I'm like, really, I'd be really down on my side. But she doing it. Doing it. And her teammates. Um, come on, the other young lady. Cute as she want to be. Um, she always dancing. Oh, I can't think of my name right now. Always dancing. Young. Hype. Hyping each other up. Encouraging each other. Folks want to talk about some hair. And I'm like, y'all stop. This year. Did y'all see girlfriend's face was beat? Mm -hmm. It was all fleet. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. Yes. But it wasn't beautiful until she hit every jump, every, every spin, every thing. That smile. No, the gymnastics. Mm -hmm. what mm -hmm. made it come inside out. Ow. Yes. And then when you look at all of those awards, mm -hmm. yes. those medals. Yes. I had to finally go back and look because, yes, she is the most decorated. She's the GOAT. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank Straight you. up GOAT. But go. all those medals. Boom, 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 boom. Every all that she goes to the Olympics, she wins. All those sacrifices. And she's had a challenge. And what did she say she's doing this year? She's going to retire. Yes. Amen. You're, you're for real? Amen. She really said that? She can't yes. do no more than what she done done. She's I mean, 27 yeah. years old. Girlfriend, girl, go out with a tablet. I mean, right. yeah, she has been on her whole life. Oh. She's been in the Olympics her whole life. Retired and something else. Mm -hmm. What else is she now? She's pregnant, ain't she? I was going to say, I know that. I know that. Now, get it. Huh. Even because I'm ready. Yes. Most people are starting to Nailed it. That's right. Because she understands her next purpose is mm -hmm. her mm -hmm. baby, That's her right. child. Mm -hmm. Being Being a her alone. She has a and that room. takes all. I think she it takes all. And now, Y'all look and y'all know when she's 27, she's changing. Sometimes your purpose does change. Yes. yes. Okay, does. hello. Mm -hmm. I've been at this five years. My purpose changed. Because mm -hmm. if you asked me six years ago, is this what I was going to be doing? No, 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 no. Because I was taking up track, running a 440. Okay? And then when I tried to hand off the baton, you dropped it. nobody would take it. Oh. <laughs> she said, she, no, nobody would take it. Nobody would take it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And I still had it. She said and she that's all right. Indeed. So now I'm running this 440 now, oh preparing you all. Yes, mm -hmm. So that when I whoop, we catch it, it's, yeah, already, got it. it's already, already in our hands. Yeah. It's already, already there. And I'm going to let it go there. and let you go. Amen. Run on. Amen. Amen. Understand? Everybody so this prep, the, this 40 that we're doing right now, don't take it for granted. It's your prep work. Yes. It's your prep work for well, you to propel yeah, into on. your yeah. purpose. Not Minister D's purpose. Not Sister D's purpose. Right. Not Odie's purpose. Mm -hmm. Not my cousin's purpose. Your, your purpose. purpose. Because the walk, the run, the the relay that I have been in, <coughs> even my own family had no idea. I didn't. I'm going to be honest. No. And the way he has taken me through life, I can look back and see it and go, that's right. Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen. Thank and you. I look now and I go, as you lead me, as you guide me, thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. I will trust you and do what you say. Mm -hmm. So when he tells me to do something, I'm like, yes, sir. Yes, sir. I'm on it. I'm doing it. I'm not giving excuses. Why me? Why not pick so and so? Why don't you get so and so? She young and she cute and she da da da. I'm like, yes, sir. Because there's a reason why you poured into me. There's a reason why you spared me. There's a reason why you keep taking care of me, Father. And I am grateful. Amen. Amen. Let us bow our hands. Most gracious and heavenly Father, we thank you for First Peter 2 9. That we are reminded that we are yours and you are ours. That you have purposed us for such a time as this, Lord. We don't take it for granted. We are grateful that you have called us each by name. You have numbered the hairs in our head, Father. You are so great and wonderful to us, Father. That those that are in our midst right now, Lord, they know you. They know you. And they want to know more about you. They want an intimate relationship with you, Heavenly Father. So as their heads are bowed, 
And as they are tuned into you, Father, speak to them. Let them hear your voice so that they continue to recognize you when you're speaking to them. That they are always listening and being obedient. We are getting ready for this time, for school time. It's becoming the end of the summer and the freedom year. But yet there's some freedom in the school time as well. But we are ready to condition ourselves to run the next race, Father. We are conditioning ourselves to go in and listen to our teacher. Lord, you have appointed each one for us. You have ordained each teacher for us, Heavenly Father. We thank you as you put our names on the right list. You put us in the right class so that we learn and we move forward so that we can run the race that you have prepared for us. We thank you for all this. And we're going to continue to give you the praise and the glory. In your precious son Jesus' name, amen. 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 You, didn't bring, you didn't bring up the one that uh, first. Uh,